Johnny O here from Johnny O's Gymnasium. Today, I'm gonna to be taking this young man through a chest workout. The workout is designed for strength and some power, and we're gonna be getting it on right here. You ready to go, baby? Let's get it. Let's get going. Okay, the first exercise that Brandon's gonna be doing is the standing chest press. This is a very unique machine. You don't see this in a lot of gyms. We have it here at Johnny O's. It has two different hand grips. The hand grip that he's using right now is, if you can see his elbows, is going to have, have, have an awful lot of shoulder work. What we're trying to do is work the chest, so he's gonna grasp it here. See how his elbows go? So now they're back and it's all chest. Let's begin, go. The beauty of this machine is there's no bar here, which allows you to bring it back much further than a traditional bench press. Continue to go. Yes, perfect, 10 reps. Now keep this going and keep this in mind that what he's doing here is for power and strength. It's to push and bring it back under control. Bringing it back under control is important about this. Now, this next exercise is my version of the incline press. As you get older, things drop. We're trying to build an upper chest here, and especially for older people, this is important. This particular exercise isolates the upper chest. He's on a Smith machine, standing. Now this is no weight. Continue to go. He's bringing this down. He's extending it fully up. And it's all the upper chest. Now, this exercise is not one that you can use a lot of weight with. We only have 10 pounds on the bar right now. And as you can see, he's getting something out of this exercise, even with 10 pounds. Remember, it's not about how much we lift, it's about the proper form. Now what he's gonna be doing is dumbbell bench presses. This is gonna build a wider chest and it's a lots of strength. This is his starting position, he kicks back, he gets into the, the proper position and he presses to the top and touches bringing it down under control. Remember, this is your starting position. This is 50%. The other 50% of the exercise is to bring it back to the starting position. Continue, perfect. Because we're working for strength, this is his first set. He's gonna be doing 15 reps each set. He's gonna be increasing the weight and decreasing the repetitions. Continue. Again, always keep the weight under control. It's not about the amount, it's about the, the quality of your form. Now we're gonna be doing the cable crossover. He's gonna be grabbing both of these. One foot is in front of the other, and watch how he pulls these, not together, but yes. The extra, when you cross over like this, you're getting an extra six to eight inches per repetition. This is perfect. Now, if you look over here, there's 13 different settings. They're an inch apart. One inch makes a difference. So try this at different angles to see how the feel is when you're doing the cable crossover. One movement can make a big difference. So experiment with this. Now the same thing, we're gonna be going down in repetitions with this. You're starting off with 15. Each set we raise the weight and we do a little bit less repetitions. Now, this is called the pec fly machine. He's finishing off with this. This is gonna be this angle right here. The last one we just did, he was coming down. It's a different angle. Now, he's starting off with his elbows slightly bent. He's bringing this close together and touching and squeezing the chest as he comes in. Open up. Bring it in again. What you're thinking here is as you're bringing that together, you wanna to think that you're hugging a tree. Okay, so that's what's gonna, it's gonna bring the most out of it. And you notice he's holding at the top for a count of one and a half or two seconds, which is enabling his chest to be isolated more. Continue. It's a perfect exercise and a great exercise to finish the workout. So, what you just saw are five of my favorite chest exercises to build size and strength. We have plenty more. Please put comments down the bottom. If there's anything that you would like to see or other body parts that you want to see, 
We're open for suggestions. Please let us know. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to our channel below. Thank you very much.